right, this is our beginner series level one. It consists of 20 drills. We're gonna run Jordan through them real quickly right here. You can work out right with them. We wanna focus on, first of all, having fun when you do these dribbles, working in speed. Speed one is 50% repetition proper mechanics. Speed two is 75% repetition proper mechanics. And speed three is out of your comfort zone. Repetition, proper mechanics with intensity equals game success. We want Jordan to really focus on maintaining his stance. He's gonna do 10 reps at speed one, 10 reps at speed two, and then 10 reps at speed three. All right, the first one we're gonna do is a ball slap right here. Give me 10 ball slaps at speed one. Just stay slow for me, Jordan. Maintain proper posture. Keep his head up. He wants to keep his back straight. All right, keep, keep going, speed two. He's speeding these up gradually. You're gonna speed them up gradually with them at home. All right, we're gonna work the speed three. Come on, push it, bang, bang, hit it, good, good. You gotta have a good handle as that ball comes in. Got your 10? Good. Now he's gonna come up right here. We're gonna do a lot of stuff to get our kids familiar with the basketball at a young age and stay shoulder width apart. Now he's gonna do a, a behind the back wrap with his right hand, starting at speed one. Speed one is 50, Jay. Good. All right, now take your ten, next 10 to speed two. Tell me when you're at three, you call it. Now, posture, good. Back straight, back straight, back straight, Jordan. Try not to hunch up. Always working on our kids maintaining proper posture and have a knee bend, even there. Now, let's take it the other way at speed one. Here we go. Speed one is 50% again. Your speed one may not look like this at first. You might fumble with speed one. Speed two, a little bit faster. His speed one's a little bit faster than the average fifth grader. Okay, good. All right, now, he's gonna go to that head wrap. All right, good. Keep your head up at all times. Try to keep your head still. Try to take out head movement. We talk a lot about that with shooting, but we want to do it right here. Stay as still as possible. He's in speed two right now. Now he's going to work it into three. When you're working for speed, working into those speeds really helps you get faster. Let's reverse it the other way now, Jordan. Start at one. Start at one. Slow it down for him a little bit more. Good. Good. This is kind of a rest for him, okay? Working on repetition with proper mechanics at speed one. Now he's working into two. Good. Let's take it to three. That a boy. Come on now. Push yourself. Every day. Yeah. See how he gets right back in? Makes the mistake. Doesn't play around. Doesn't walk to the ball. Hops back in. Good job. Good job. Now we're going to go waist head. Waist head at speed one. Now he's still an upper body part here. Good. Uh, our younger kids don't. We don't have them lifting weights in fifth grade. But what we do have them doing is some ball wrap stuff because we think it's good for our younger kids to help them build some endurance and stand them on and make them stronger with their ball. He's at three right now, he's working at ten. That a boy. Come on now. It's alright. Get tired. Alright, start to make mistakes. How are you going to deal with adversity? Good. Let's go left. We like to teach our players at a young age how to deal with adversity. Things aren't always going to go your way. Good. Come on now. Working into three. He's getting tired. You get tired, the drill gets hard. These drills would be killing me about right now, just like they are him. Good. Get your 10. Get your 10. 